Hey guys. Here is Digiber channel. If you are an iPhone user, you may probably meet with the iPhone unavailable screen. It shows up on your iPhone when you forgot the passcode and entered the wrong ones continuously to the device. You have 10 chances to guess. If you can't enter the right passcode for the 10th times, you will be locked out permanently from your unavailable iPhone. Don't worry. There's still a way to get back to your iPhone again. That is to reset your iPhone. Note that although you can remove the iPhone unavailable screen by a reset, all your data will be erased too. Wish you have a backup earlier, so you can retrieve the data after the reset. And today we'll introduce you three ways to perform a factory reset on your iPhone when you forgot the passcode. The first method we'll talk about is using Erase iPhone feature. It's a rather new function that comes with the launch of iOS 15.2. Therefore, to use this method to reset your unavailable iPhone, your iPhone needs to run iOS 15.2 or later. What's more, the device should enable network connection beforehand. And your Apple ID and password should be in hand too. However, a computer is not needed to do the reset in this way. Let's look at the steps then. First off, keep entering wrong passcode until you get the iPhone unavailable screen where you can see the erase iPhone option in the bottom right corner. Tap it. Tap again to confirm the reset. Next, enter the Apple ID password to sign out and tap the same option to trigger the reset. Soon your iPhone will automatically reset itself. When it's done, the iPhone unavailable screen will be gone. And you will see a hello screen instead. Then you can start the iPhone over again, or recover the data from your latest backup. If you can't take this method because of some limitations, keep watching to learn about the following two methods. Next, we'll introduce you another way to reset your unavailable iPhone. That is by Find My iPhone in iCloud. Just take another device which can get in a browser, and you can easily erase the iPhone unavailable screen by this means, even when you don't have your iPhone nearby. But be reminded that the Find My iPhone feature needs to be enabled on your iPhone previously. Like the Erase iPhone feature, you should also know about your Apple ID password and connect your iPhone to network in prior. In order to fix an unavailable iPhone by this means, you need to navigate to iCloud.com in a browser on another phone, tablet, or computer. Here we'll use an iPad to show you the steps. Log in with your Apple account details. And click Find iPhone here. Later you will see a map. It will show the real-time locations of all the iOS devices under your Apple ID. Also in the top, there's a list of all devices. Click on it and pick the unavailable iPhone. With three options offered, select Erase iPhone. At last, hit Erase to let the reset begin. When the reset is over, you can then unlock your unavailable iPhone and start it anew. Speaking of the final method, iPhone Unlocker. It's an efficient passcode removal tool that can easily reset your unavailable iPhone, no matter if your iPhone connects to network or you forgot the Apple ID password. Moreover, this can erase not only a forgotten passcode, but also a screen time passcode and Apple ID password. If you are interested, come to check more details in this website. You can copy the address directly from the description below. Let's see how to use this tool to fix the iPhone unavailable screen. Firstly, download and install the software on your Mac or PC. Open it. Select Wipe Passcode from the main menu. Hit Start. 
Follow the link here to make your iPhone enter recovery mode and get it detected. When the device is read, confirm the information of your iPhone. An appropriate iOS software will begin to download. Once it's done, you will be prompted to enter 0000 to confirm the reset. Input as required and hit unlock. Your iPhone will then get into the reset process. After it's finished, you can start it from scratch or recover the data from backup. Well, that's all for today's video. If you have any questions, feel free to ask and comment below. Also please hit the like button and subscribe to us for more latest videos. Thanks.